Okay, we are looking good. So, again, these guys have a voice start. Meal's going to trigger it in voice chat. We don't know when they're starting. That was very equal from the top four. That was perfect from the top four. Maybe milliseconds between them. That was so equal. Roughly on the inside of TT. Tice on the inside of TT. Side by side into turn three. Gold Rose is clear of Gapple. TT breaks late. Does he avoid the fence? He does. Does Tice on the outside. They're side by side here. That's... Okay. Tice backs out. It's not the end of the world. But it's a strong start for GTC. Much better than their first race on Thursday. Much better luck this time around. So, closing out lap one, crashed on me in the lead, with TT behind, Profi, Tice, Goldbros and Gapple. GTC with the points advantage for now as it stands. TT under pressure from Profi, but he's clearing to turn three. Gapple? Gets around Gold Rose. I didn't see how that was set up. These guys really settle into their pace now. They got enough of a buffer just to start looking at doing some consistent lap times. They don't have to run defensive lines, they can just drive. Profi is excited. He wants to close that gap. And Titi's super wide there. That's where there's no grip. He would have lost probably four tenths of a second, three tenths of a second. Top four still within just over a second. Ties with the fastest lap of a 19.6. So yeah, these guys are just getting closer and closer. Oh, that's a bad exit from Profi. Tice might just go past him into turn three. Gapple's got a nice buffer to Gold Rose. Yeah, Profi lets Tice go. The wheel machine. Let's jump on board. Ah, huh? ah. Huh. Wow, it looks like TT's closing into Crash Dummy. So they're going to start slowing each other down. And Tice is hot on their heels. And he's got a much better entry than both of them there. It's really closing in. Much better exit. Ooh, and TT spoke too soon. Again, faster lap, 119.58 for Tice. Everyone's in the 19s apart from uh, Gold Bros at the moment. That was a bit dicey from Tice there. Come on, Tice. He's hungry. He's laying down the fast laps. 
bit of consistency and he's back on Titi's ass. As you can see from the map on the left, there's a really good gap between Profi, Gapple and Goldbros. Probably a second between Profi and Gapel, and then two seconds between Gapel and Goldbros. And both with very weird lines into here for GTC. They're not getting that corner right at all. Much better this time around for Tice. Is he going to make a move to the... No, he backs out. But someone just went with a new gold lap, crashed on me with a, one th a 119.382. Closely followed by Tice on a 0.39. Tice wants to get past TT as soon as possible. Yeah, I agree with you there, Robin. Makes more sense, because then... Um, yeah, they've got a much better chance of holding the position. Oof! we got a run here. TT moved to defend, but it was too late. Tice has got the inside line. Titi's got a great exit, great defence. Wonderful driving from Titi there. And we're back where we were, closing the last lap. Tice right on his back bumper going into turn one. Crashed on me with another fastest lap, I believe. Profi with an even faster lap, 119.0. Yeah, it's quite nice. It's a bit of a lazy perspective for me. I don't have to do any chasing. I don't have to do any camera magic. We also get to enjoy Tice's smooth wheel inputs. I don't know if you can see it on the stream. Those wipers are not very clean. The wipers themselves are brown. All crashed on with a bad line there. Might back up TT a little bit. Tice. Hot on their tail again. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Tice had fastest lap for a moment there, but TT, first one into the 118s, 118.958. Tice going for a switchback. Oh, I forgot that does two things. It's not what I wanted to do. Crashed on me a bit wide, gets into the fence. I might slow down TT on the back stretch. They're going to be proper bunched up going into the uphill section. Oh, desync. We love to see it. Tice with the best line of all three, I think. Yeah, he's going to get a run into the hairpin there. That's a bit dodgy from TT. Tice using all the track that he can. He's backing out there. Nothing happening at the back. Gapple. Healthy gap to Goldbros. Profi's hunting down the top three. I know he was doing the fastest laps a moment ago. 
I think he's still holding it. Yeah, still holding that 118.9 as fastest lap. If he gets second, they will win, I think. Right? I don't know. One of these days, I need to try and understand the points. Oh, really? Ah! Oh. That's an easy way to look at it, isn't it? I reckon if Tice and Titi are battling, Profi's going to close that gap, no problem. So. Going to be interesting. Tice in the 118s now. Profi with a 118.6 as fast as lap. They're all in the 118s now. Oh, the top four. 189, 189, 189, 118, 118.6. Tice is getting really strong exits here every lap. Super consistent in this section. Time traveler on a defensive line. Just forces Tice to be uh, a little easier on the entry, but that's a great exit from Tice. He's going straight for the apex. They're side by side. He backs out. Going into the final lap. Everyone just improving their fastest laps just a little bit. Ties forced wide again. They are bumper to bumper. Great line from Tice. Titi's gone wide on the straight. Bit of contact. I think they're good. Tice goes for the move on the inside. Clips the inside a little bit, but they're going to be side by side going into the last corner. Oh. They're going to be side by side going over the finish as well. That was so close. I was even closer than the meal and AQ. Wow. 14 milliseconds. What a race. 